Okay, it is um, 10.33 in the evening and I am um, just driving through Belanglo State Forest um, to meet my friends. Um, we're going to be camping at Daly's Campground. It is currently 3 degrees Celsius. Um, I've got my high beams on at the moment. Um, it's like a dirt road, it's pretty bumpy, it, it's probably more suitable for um, four-wheel driving. Um, so I wasn't able to come earlier, I had uh, dinner with my nieces in the city today, uh, in Sydney. Um, so I left around 9 and it took me about 1 hour and 34 minutes from the city to Belanglo State Forest um, and yeah it's a waxing moon um, tonight so that we've got a little bit of uh, moonlight which is good it's it's a pretty clear sky so hopefully um, I think it is I can see the moon but um but yeah there's if you don't know about Belanglo State Forest, um, this is where uh, the Ivan Milat was famous for, notorious for. Um, so there's a lot of, um, you know, stories about murders. Um, even I think his nephew also murdered somebody here, his friend. Um, so you can go on YouTube and even have a look. At, um, when you when you Google or YouTube um, search for Belanglo State Forest, Ivan Milat comes up, and um, even news stories about what's happened here. So you need to do a protection for yourself coming into here because obviously with people being murdered um, and buried here, um, there's obviously a lot of um, Know, bad energy. I was really thinking about why am I coming here, but I really wanted to come camping with, go camping with some friends. Um, and we're it, it's it's actually around Sawai. So if you're a weekend, um, we're coming up to um, yeah. In the southern hemisphere, this is what we celebrate if you're weekend, and it's what the what people in the Northern Hemisphere would usually celebrate um, for Halloween. So this is when the time between the veils have thinned. Um, we are just coming into winter time. So it is very, very cold <laughs> getting there, very cold. And um, so yeah, that's another reason to come out um, somewhere and do some protection as well for this time for me. A lot of bad energy coming from the internet. Uh, a lot of people being really hurtful and hateful. So taking a break from social media, as in Instagram and Facebook, because it's just a lot. It's just too much. It's getting a bit too heavy and emotional. And I want to take a break and look after my mental health. So um, why not come to a forest? <laughs> um, and, and camp when it's cold and, and um, you can see the fog a little bit uh, in real life I guess the fog's a little bit thicker um, like I said I've got my high beams on so it's going to train the fog a bit more but um, yeah i got two friends who are already waiting for me at the campground this is the first time I've come to this place oh look it's cleared up now that's good <laughs> um, yeah so So hopefully it'll be a good couple of nights out here, away from the city, away from people, a bit of a break from work, I saw, um, so yeah, really wanted to see what it was like out here, just have a different experience. I'm actually going to be making poppets over the next couple of days, um, and that's part of my protection as well. 
Um, I also went to Mind Body Spirit Festival today. Um, that was at Darling Harbour. And I bought myself some black obsidian, hematite, um, the tourmaline, black tourmaline, amethyst bracelet, rose quartz bracelet, um, uh, Palo Santo, and frankincense. So, um, and, and I got it from a guy who is actually from Peru. Um, so I wanted to make sure, like, you know, it was ethically sourced and it was going to the right people, you know, the profits and stuff from the sale. So I also got a, um, a, a, a proper Incan or Peru, Peruvian uh, ceremonial blanket so I can start making proper ritual space for myself. So with this break off Facebook and, and Instagram especially and um, having a break from performance I want to do more ritual for myself um, really get back into my spirituality my Wiccan studies my own uh, as a solitary practitioner so more meditation I've been playing a lot of protection chants um, I used to petition Kali a lot so I've been playing Kali um, protection against evil um, and that was been really good so yeah um, because I'm polytheist as in I draw from different spiritualities I feel like that's what helps me to feel um, safe and protected spiritually but I definitely am going to um, do it more pro like protection tonight especially in the forest where people were murdered <laughs> um, and also have obviously my own other protection stuff so for physical protection in case you know there are people who are um, not um, well and have bad intentions um, so not just spiritual uh, malicious entities but physical ones as well doll here. Look, people have left things there. What, your fucking Annabelle doll? Yeah, no. the one that talks. No. Oi! <laughs> what is it? What? How many people were here? 
Come here. Touching my grave. Yeah. Oh, we're not going to touch your grave. No. Just want to pay our respects to the people who were murdered here. I'm not here to disturb you. I hope you can find some peace. How many people are here? Four? Five at the moment. Five at the moment. How did you die? What's your name? Who's here now? <laughs> Sorry, what did you say? <laughs> Should we go? Is Simone here? If someone's here, can you make it go red? Do you mind if the dog's there? Not, he would be by himself. I'll be like, bye. <laughs> Do you like the dog? I heard it's little. He is little. He's a good dog. Kind of a good dog. Kind of kind of pooed in your like memorial spot. I'm so sorry that he pooed there. I picked it up. I hope you don't mind. Can you make my device go red if you're here? There seems to be a male's voice. Mostly a male, yeah. I think that there was a little bit of a lady's voice sometimes, a couple of times. Yeah. You nearly got to red. Got up to orange. Got up to orange. If you like the dog, can you make it go red? The dog feels comfortable here. Yeah. Because if he can feel bad, bad vibes, he'd probably growl. He wouldn't be out here, down next to these memorial.
Thank you for letting us know you're here. We're sorry this happened. Yeah. I'm sorry this was a tragedy. So bad. I hope you can rest in peace. Ivan Millette's dead now. You do know? Is it a butterfly? Did you know Ivan Millette's dead? Was his death a tragedy? What is it? Etchings on the ground. Yeah. Etchings? Yeah. Toby. What does that say? I don't know what that says. Toby. Which what? way? Do you know what they wrote on the ground? Well, so, I don't know what's written down. Are there more people that haven't been found yet? No wedding. No wedding. No wedding. No wedding. Yeah. Why is Simone separate? And what's that other chair thing? Okay. Go, go sit in the car and burn sage. Burn the Palo Santo so they don't come with us. I had it so soon. Huh? I had it so soon. And maybe I had it wrong. Who else is here? You're here. Thanks for being here. Can you make the device go red if you're here? Who's talking? What's your name? Who's the lady there talking? Is it Simone? Joanne Leslie?
No. Okay. Oh. That's Toby. Can you say hello to Toby? Yeah, we're just here to pay our respects. We just ask you to stay here. We'll move on to the light. Rest in peace. Don't follow us home. Walking. We'll leave you here. And thank you for letting us be here. Did you die in January? Okay, we're gonna go. I will leave you here. Please don't follow us. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Bye. One? Did you say one? Did you want to say something before we leave? No? Okay. Thank you. We're going to go now. Bye. <laughs> All right. I'm cleansing the our space around. <laughs> and just ask all the spirits to stay where you are. Please don't follow us. Stay there. <laughs> I'm saging myself. Ask for the goddess's protection. Palo Santo. And I am putting protection sigils around around my van because we just went to the memorial at Belengo Forest where people got murdered and um, did the spirit box and I lit some Palo Santo as well.